Curtis, a, a disappointing result. How do you uh, assess your team's performance? Yeah, disappointing result. Um, I just said to the lads there, you know, it, it, it'd be wrong of me to go in there and, and tear strips off the lads when they're doing their best. And our best isn't very good. And, and that's the harsh reality, you know. So, so the lads in there, you know, if it, if it barks like a dog and walks like a dog, then it's a dog. You know, when we, uh, and that's us, that's our level. That's where we're at, you know, and it's, it's not the level that I want from a team that I manage. It's not the level that games with Trinity want, but that's where we're at. You know, that, that's, that's where we're at this season. You know, it is what it is. We've got what we've got. We've got nothing else coming in. You know, I think we had six teenagers in, in there today. Um, and it is what it is. So it's wrong of me to, to shout and scream and have a go at the lads when they're doing all they can. But at the minute, we're just not good enough. And, and do you put that down to the, the, the players that are missing the injuries? No, no. I just think we're not good enough. And, and that's how it is, you know. In sport, in, in everything, I just said in there, you know, you find your level of, of where you're at, you know, whether it be professional sport, whether it be as a sales rep, you know, you get to the level that, that you're at and that's your level. And we, we the level of, of us is not great at the minute. So, like I said to you before, and it isn't manager talk, whenever we get a win, we need to celebrate it because it's going to be a long, hard season. Like I said, we've got, I reckon, I don't know, I don't want to talk percentages, but a good percentage of that team isn't good enough for where I want to be as a manager. Do you feel there are things that can be done to make this team better? Yeah, we need some new players. And that's not likely to happen? No. You know, like I said, this is us for the rest of the season, so... You know, we need to we need to get on with it and do the best we can. Like I said, the lads are doing the best they can, but we're just not good enough. Uh, and today, Peterborough were a very good team as well. Yeah, good side. Um, caused us a, a lot of problems. Um, and yeah, they, I think they were, they were rightful winners. You know, they, they deserve the victory. So, well done to them. Uh, no complaints from me. You know, from the large periods, you know, it looked like a, a men's team against a boys team. And, you know, an under-21s team, really against a, a men's team and that's kind of how the game panned out and, and like you say though, the team they kept going and they managed to get themselves back into the game how frustrating was it to then go behind more or less straight away yeah it was frustrating to once we went back to 2-2 two, two, you know I, I mean I was delighted to get in the dressing room at 2-1 down at half time because I thought we'd have a chance of maybe getting back into the game so once we got back to 2-2 two, two, you know I was, I was happy and kind of thought can we pull some out of the bag but we never looked like you know going on to win the game to be honest like I said it just it looked like uh, a bunch of men against uh, an under 18, under 21 team. You know, we're just, like I said, I don't want to be too harsh on the lads because, like I said, they're, they're doing the best they can. So it's not fair for me to, to be harsh on people that are doing their best. And um, so I refuse to come out and, and hammer anybody or anything like that because we're doing their best, but our best just isn't good enough. Uh, one positive to get the three under 21s on today. Yeah, brilliant. And all three of them did brilliant. When they came on, it gives that bit of injection, you know, they ran around, they tackled. Like, like I said to them, they did their best. And that's all you can ask from, from the team that you put out is, is they give their best. And the three lads that came on, they like it from, I think it's the, the debut for the first team. Um, and yeah, we're going to be using them more often. I think, like I said, today we had three subs and a goalkeeper. Um, we didn't have Kamal Grant. Um, and we've got, I think, got seven out injured. Um, so yeah, it, it is what it is. We've just got to do the best we can in the circumstances and like I said it, for, for me as manager it's, it's very very frustrating this isn't where I want to be doing doing this but it is the circumstances we're under so we're just going to make the best of what we can so it's important like I said to you, you know we can't we can't be too down in the dumps when we get beat and we can't be too high when we win this is going to be us for the rest of the season up down up down win lose win lose and some days are going to really really frustrate me and other days I'm going to be pleasantly surprised but is what it is uh, finally, we're not, not quite sure what the announcement's going to be um, regarding COVID. We're not quite sure when games we're next going to play. Yeah. Um, do you think a break might do the team good? Well, it'll, it'll help us get some players back and we need... We need we, but, <laughs> like I said, I don't want to be too negative, but we need some players in. You know, we, need, we need some players in. and, and I'm, I'm, I know everyone's trying their best, so like I said, I'm not having a goal. But we need players in, you know, we, we, we're just, we're, we're way off the standards that, that we, we set as a, as, a, as a football club for me. So we need players in. No one wants to go into lockdown though, you know, no. like I said, this is only football, you know, it is only football, you know, we've got, people have got to get on with the rest of their lives and I don't, I'll hopefully we won't go into lockdown, but I think it looks like what I'm hearing is we're going to go into lockdown for a month, so hopefully we'll use that to get a few players back and, and hopefully get a few more through the door, but 
Does that mean we carry on playing? I don't understand what it is yet. So, who knows? I said to the lads before the game, you know, we've got to treat it like it's going to be our last game for a while together. So, go out and, and do your best. And like I said, the lads give their best. But our best just is, is way, way short of what we need to be. Uh, finally, message for the travelling sport. Again, there seems to be plenty scattered about here today. Yeah, they've made the effort to come over. Disappointing for them to, to, to kind of go away after watching that. You know, we went out with a little bit of a whimper. Well, yeah, they get behind us week in, week out, so we're very, very grateful of that. And like I said, at our level, without fans, the, the club doesn't exist. So we're more, we're more than grateful. It's just a shame we couldn't really deliver a performance today. Okay, thank you. Thank you.